In a world where technological advancements move at lightning speed, the release of the Prusa Mark IV-S on August 12th, 2024, begs the question, how can you follow up an already revolutionary product, aka the Prusa Mark IV, which debuted only just a year ago in March 2023, and further define our expectations? Well, the Mark IV isn't just an upgrade, it's a testament to the relentless pursuit of perfection inside of 3D printing. But what exactly sets it apart? Why should you care? Let's delve into the differences that make the MK4S a revolution in the realm of additive manufacturing. You are watching a master of work. If you've been in the world of 3D printing for at least five years or more, you will already know that Prusa has managed to climb to the top of the, one of the most respected 3D manufacturers, often copied but never equaled. With defining customer service and the very definition of quality excellence, Prusa has built a loyal user base. And in recent years, with products like the Mark IV, the XL, the Prusa Pro HT90, as well as the acquisition of industrial 3D printing company Trilab and the USA-based filament and printer reseller Printed Solid, Prusa has further bolstered their service and delivery offerings. With that all said, what separates the MK4S apart from the MK4? Well, in the past, the Prusa's S and S Plus models were essentially a collection of reliability upgrades, improvements on parts, and easier maintenance. But this time, it seems that we're looking at a more than just a subtle evolution. The Mark IV S represents a leap forward, with additional hardware propelling the Prusa brand into the future, even if it's kicking and screaming along the way. Revolutionary 360 cooling experience a completely redesigned high-performance cooling system, taking a bold step away from the Mark IV design. Custom high-flow nozzles developed in collaboration with Bontech. This new nozzle promises unparalleled efficiency and precision. Native mobile, app and Wi-Fi setup seamlessly control and monitor your prints with the all-new mobile app and easy Wi-Fi setup feature. Enhanced durability, many original 3D printed parts are now crafted from the PC blend carbon fiber with LCD cover upgraded to injection molding. GPIO board integration, unlock the functionalities with the added GPIO board, perfect for makers seeking enhanced customization. So it suddenly dawned on me while I was editing this video that you might not know what GPIO actually stands for and it's general purpose input and output. So you could take a signal or an analog or a digital signal and make that do something. So for instance, if you wanted a servo to move a particular way, you could use this technology to kind of open doors or make something happen as a reaction to something. It's a bit like asking Alexa to maybe turn on some music, that kind of thing. GPIO, where could we find a reliable PCB company um, for GPIO? Well, I've got good news because this video is sponsored by PCB Way and they are an excellent resource for GPIO projects due to their high quality, customizable PCB manufacturing services. When working with GPIOs, you often need a custom designed PCB to effectively manage and route multiple connections. And well, PCB Way offers precise fabrication, allowing you to design the boards and tailor your specific GPIO pin layouts and requirements. They support complex, multi-layer boards and various materials, ensuring reliability for your project. Additionally, PCB Way provides an assembly service which can save you time by soldering components directly onto your custom PCBs, streamlining your GPIO-based project development. Check them out over at PCBWay.com. Thank you, guys. Accelerometer support. Printer modders will rejoice with the addition of the accelerometer support, paving the way for innovative modifications. But surely, if you already own a Mark IV now, is there an upgrade path, right? Well, yes, in fact, Prusa has promised these additions in an upgrade package, allowing you to upgrade to all these new features for a minimal price, which is to be announced. Let's get down into some of these new features. The Prusa promise, of course, includes quality, and inside of the care package, they supplied some test prints that were made on the Mark IV S. However, I went ahead and actually made some of my own, and while there was only a short time to work and edit on this video, it gave me enough time to understand the direction that they're heading in. So the first thing you're going to notice is probably the cooling fan and the new 360 cooling fan incorporates a high pressure cooling fan, which is so efficient that it only runs at 70% most of the time. This allows for extreme overhangs up to 75 degrees without the need of supports. And while it does look kind of big and bulky versus the Mark IV, the point is to enhance the speed and reduce the need for supports, saving on material and 3D printing time. 
bringing in the high flow. Well, the flow rates have been increased thanks to this new hot end, allowing you to print faster with higher flow rates. For example, the increase in flow rate for PLA goes from 16 millimeters squared to 24 millimeters squared on a 0.4 nozzle and from 16 mm squared to 30 mm squared on a 0.6 nozzle. These values are tested with standard materials and unlike the in vogue high flow filaments, this does mean that further increases are possible as changes to material are certainly forthcoming. An introduction to the Prusa app. Now, at the time of making this video, the app is very much still in beta. However, I was able to download the app and the functionality and what you can really do right now are really just kind of overviewing your 3D printers. You can print, you can pause, you can stop, and there's push notifications. So for example, when the print finishes, when the color changes, etc., well, it notifies you. Print jobs and overviews of browsing and even starting prints from printable.com are going to be some additional features that are going to be coming soon, which is super exciting. In fact, this feature is actually what I'm most fond of, and I'd love to see this implemented on the Excel. My personal workflow requires the ability to be able to start prints remotely or when I'm on the go while also monitoring them. So this is a great introduction to making that capability viable. The 3D printed parts on the 3D printed printer are now printed in PPCF. So personally, having owned Prusa printers in the past, the quality and strength and materials used on those printers have never really concerned me. However, I can understand that a more durable material represents a significant step in the evolution of this printer. The injection molded LCD cover is also a nice touch and the touch screen is well more than welcome for this particular change but of course the devil is most certainly in the detail let's talk gpio now this is a break from the norm while some printer manufacturers shy away from discussions around source code open source and uh printer modifications. Prusa, well, certainly embraces them. The GPIO board actively supports all things moddable, using G-code commands to encourage projects involving remote camera triggers, smart LED lights, servo controls, and, well, much more. So if you want your printer to startle you awake when a print is finished or done in the middle of the night, or even give your dog a treat when the print is finished, well, this opens up a range of new innovative ideas. Now, input shaping. Now, this one is certainly one for the models, and while the Mark IV already includes this technology, it truly shines if you're looking to tinker with your machine. An optional accelerometer can also be added to further tweak and fine-tune your setup, although this might not be my area of expertise. If input shaping is important and a feature that you want to see more of, well, let me know about that in the comments below. Prusa continues to lead the change in 3D printing innovation, constantly refining and enhancing their printer lineup to deliver exceptional quality and reliability. With the recent addition of Wi-Fi and Prusa connectivity, they have introduced features that I'm personally excited to champion. My recent projects, such as the tiny bike, have only deepened my appreciation for Prusa's contribution into this field. And revisiting Prusa's product lineup is like taking a journey back to the roots of 3D printing. It's a reminder of how the industry has evolved from its grassroots beginning, and Prusa has always been at the forefront of promoting open design, 100% privacy, open functionality, and open source principles. Their commitment to plug and print simplicity ensures that you can go from unboxing to printing in under 10 minutes. This dedication not only underscores Prusa's pioneering spirit, but also the unwavering focus on making 3D printing as accessible and innovative for all. While communication with Prusa has always been very, very positive, like all manufacturers, my thoughts and comments on certain products are really very much my own and that can't be bought or swayed. And of course, my professional integrity, certainly on YouTube, is very, very important to me. But I have to say, the Mark IV S is very good. Having worked on projects with the Prusa brand and listening to the community who often voice their opinions very loudly, I must tell you that Prusa still makes incredible machines and the future is very bright. To reach this point, I have had to stop using some other brands for a little bit to relearn the fundamentals of 3D printing. This process made me realize that actually skipping steps or cutting corners diminishes the value and potential of this remarkable technology. The Prusa team have been listening to you, the community, and the Mark IV-S marks a sign of positive things to come. Now, if you are interested in an MK4-S by Prusa, it comes in two forms. The first one is a kit form, and if you order in the next two weeks of this video going live, you will also receive a spool of PLA filament. Now, the price on that kit is $799. Now, option number two is to buy a pre-built version, which is exactly the versions that we've got here. Each one of those are specially picked, 
and built by the lovely people at Prusa. And allegedly, Joseph Prusa lays a single kiss on each one of those machines as they're packed into the box and they are waved off by him as they go out of the factory door. Now, if you do want one of those, it's $1,099. And again, the two week deal still applies you get a free sport of PLA as well. Now, links for all these and any associated discounts that may or may not be associated with this video right now, because we are a few days away from the launch, will be in the links below. So it's really important that you do hit those links below. And while you're there, you might as well click that subscribe button and that notification bell and maybe chuck us a little like as well. Another reason to possibly want to subscribe is that I am about to head to the Prusa factory in the next couple of days. I'm meeting its boy in space out there. We're going to be doing some cool filming and we're going to be doing a factory tour. So I want to be able to bring that content to you. There is going to be some amazing content coming out very, very soon. Again, we've already spoken about the tiny bikes and there are more Print My Ride projects that are in the ether of my brain at the moment. Anyway, the MK4S is a remarkable machine. Did we expect anything less from Prusa? The prints look stunning. And again, hopefully throughout this video, you would have seen how the prints have come out. And well, we just knew how it was going to go. It is faster. It does look impressive. And um, I'm going to continue to use it. So if you want to see more footage like that, where you know what to do, Thank you very much for watching. The links, as always, will be down in the description below. All my links and stuff will also be in my link tree. So make sure you check out that description. I might have already said that. But anyway, thanks for watching. Guys, we will see you soon. Bye for now. You are watching a master at work.